Sweeney once again. Tim Kerr on the mic. Upper St. Clair Boys High School Varsity Lacrosse. Hosting tonight, Peters Township. Peters Township 1-0 on the season, beating Pine Wilton. Upper St. Clair 2-0, coming off wins from Char Valley and Erie McDowell the other night. We'll set the faceoff. Braden Cobb on a faceoff. Ball loose. Ben Southern chases. Ball still loose. Peters Township recovers. Peters Township into set. We'll set the defense for the Panthers. We have Ben Southern, <coughs> Colin Liss, and Mark Panko for the Panthers. Attack, we have Braden Kybe, David Rice. And who else do we have out there? Let's have another long stick midi. It'll be Alex Gallimus out there. On Ball back to Peters, <coughs> behind the net. Right side wide, back up top. Peters set up in a 2-2-2, gonna dodge from up top. Good defensive work there by David Rice, shuts that down, look inside. Gotta have quick recovery, quick feet. Peters Township moves the ball well, very good move on attack, good save. Gavin Keith steady on that save. Peters Township re remains, retains possession. Good curl inside, inside out, ball loose. Colin List with a pickup. <clears throat> Panthers look to clear. Giveaway, Peters Township ball. Same people after, after St. Clair give and go, inside out, decides not to shoot. Resets. Peters now on a 1-4-1 set. Alex Gallimus with good chase behind. Colin Liss on the side, ball up top. Perennial rival here at Peters Township, cross inside, shot wide. First man there, Peters Township, Peters Township ball. 10-14 to go in the first quarter, no score. From behind, good pressure out of the Panthers. You gotta be very quick on a very strong attack from Peters Township. Takes his man through the crease. Front to back, slide, side, oh, save. I don't know if Poster Gavin made that save. Good play, let's go, work it clear, boys. David Rice looks to clear. Give and go, little dodge. Two men to beat, has sideline to run. Made it down the sideline, looks good, goes inside, he's got room. Swim move, he'll step it in, settle. Trevor Morrow comes in, so we have Morrow, or, or uh, Braden Kybe inside, David Rice. Mac Matson, Kyle Page, and Tommy Fitch on attack. Have not seen the ball yet. Peters Township rush up field. They got numbers, fast break, look inside, give and go. Oh, boy, lost the handle there, we got lucky. Peters Township wide open on the crease on that breakaway. Got to have your head on the swivel ball. Aaron Pass did not get out yet, chase down. Trevor Morrow gives chase, picks it up, loose ball, out of bounds. Little anxiety, little nerves from both teams probably. These kids play in the summer for and against each other. Peters up top. Little pick move, we have a switch. Trevor Morrow gives chase, bounce shot, goes wide. Gavin Key's getting a lot of action tonight against Erie McDowell, had not a lot of action, not a lot of action was in his end. We possessed the ball well, game of possession. Ball from behind, our spotter's bringing me the lineup for Peters Township, give you a little heads up on who's on that team. Peters makes a switch. Back up top. All right, Peters will make a change. Sheets with the ball behind, looks inside, shot save, good save. Excuse me, that was Filoni. Panthers had the ball, run up cross, oh, another bad pass. Come on, guys, you got to clear. Pick up Braden Kai, rumbles down the field, got two men, finds Kyle Page, look one more. Shot scored, good job, nice. Kyle Page to Mac Matson, beautiful pass. Panther goal, number 21, Mac Matson, assisted by number 22, Kyle Page. Nice work. Braden Kai brought the ball up very well. Quick give and go, one more pass. 
finish by Panthers. 7.53 to go in the first. Try to get the Peters names correct for you. Ryan Betzel on the faceoff. Peters Township controls. Fall out of bounds. Can't chase it down. It's going to go Panthers. Good D by the Panthers. Andrew Bartuzic has a ball. Finds Ben Southern far side. Back to Gavin Keith. He'll walk it up. See what the Panthers do here on the clear. Little switch at midfield. Finds Bartuziak. He's got to use his speed, get across the field. Clock's ticking, boys. Let's go. Failure to advance. A little too long on that clear, Panthers. 1 0 Panthers, 7 20 in the first. Peters will make some changes. Sheets behind. Hers up top. Looks to dodge. Good pressure, Ben Tobias. Oh, loses a loses a tire. Ball down. Oh, he looks injured out there. Get off, Benny. Peters maintains possession. He's going to look at Dodge. He got a man down. Kaib on defense. Herzog looks at Dodge from up top. Left side. Dodge shot score. Nice shot. Is that Filoni? Township goal number 20, Maloney, unassisted. Nice shot from outside, about 15 yards out. <coughs> Ties the score. 6 17 to go in the first. Betzel on the faceoff for the Panthers. Peters win. It's going to be a big difference tonight. We have pretty strong faceoff men, they do also. Peters will step it in, make some changes. Sheets behind. Little bounce pass, unintended, I'm sure. Pike. Top right. Panthers. Oh, what do we have? Must be a failure to advance. Panthers run the ball up. Trevor Morrow will bring it in. David Rice has the ball, take it in, steps it in, stick check. Loose ball, who's got it? Who wants it? Scrum inside, loose ball, oh, push it ahead, Peters with the ball. Row pass, one more, oh, a little high, they had numbers. Chase down on the corner. Colin lifts, good defensive play, good stick check, ball's down. Going to have a play on. Trevor Moore with a ball. He's down. They're going to get a push with possession. Panthers will be man up for the first time tonight. Five oh three to go to first. Score is tied. Let's get the call. Is that a slash? What? I know that. Penley, Peters Township, one minute, slash. Play is whistled on. Let's see, we have out there, we have Betzel, Ryan Kincaid, Kyle Page, Tommy Fitch, Andrew Bartuziak, and David Rice. That's our man up team. Panthers will work it around. Easy go around one or two times, set some inside screens. Kincaid into the crease. Rice looks to shoot, dumps to Betzel, nothing there. Peters packed in pretty tight, challenging the Panthers. Betzel up top, nothing there, finds Page, one more. 
Kincaid finds nothing to shoot at. Tommy Fitch is open low. Betzel with a shot. Score. Woo! From the top. Nice shot. Ryan Betzel. Panther goal, number 15, Ryan Betzel. Good work there on our man up. Worked the ball around well, possessed it. Good clean shot. 4.22 to go in the first. 2 1 Panthers. A lot of action so far. We didn't see it. Peters had a very good game against Pine Richland. Panthers had a couple easy opponents early on. A lot of action so far. Clock's ticking pretty quick tonight. Kive on a face off. Scrums it out. Loose ball pick up Peters. Steps it in. They look to settle, bring some men on. Sheets back at X. Looks inside for the dodge. Oh, I don't know if that was post or Gavin. Either way, didn't go in. Good dodge from behind. Peter's ball. If we can contain the X position, we'll be fine. Kachi looks to dodge. Has man to beat. Can't turn. Good work on from Colin Liss. Panthers down a few men tonight. Christian Teal, senior defense, men out. And Colin Kerr, out. Shot save, Gavin. A lot of action tonight. She's behind, looks to dodge, takes his man one way, comes back. Panthers ready for that, back up top. Skip pass across. Ooh, no dodge, went into his foot. He got a little bit of an ankle with a stick. That didn't work. Penley Panthers. So we'll see Peters Township man up for the first time tonight. Guess we'll call that a trip. What do you think? There's the call. Penley, Upper St. Clair, one minute tripping. Well, it's hard to score if you get tripped, right? Okay, that's set our defense. We've got Mike Cullian, sophomore LSM out there. Ben Tavias, sophomore midi inside. And Liss Panko Southern. Panthers packing in tight. Keep an eye on sheets inside on the crease. Peters with a 2 2 2. See if we have a dodge up top. Going to try to get a man loose. Shot wide. Peters here to cover. Step back in. Up top, shot quick. Ooh, good save again. Gavin Keith's seen the ball well tonight. Nice quick shot on goal. Ben Southern, good play to clear. Finds Colian, who finds Kyle Page. Ball still loose. Box out. You get a push. Panther ball. Mark Mac Matson has the ball. We need another player. Get out there, son. Okay, Tommy Fitch runs on. We have Matson, Fitch, Page, Bartusiak. And Betzel. Penalty's released. We need someone out there. Or he's not even almost released. David Rice will step in in a few seconds. We're even. Panthers set up wide. Right side to Kyle Page. Directs David Rice. Maybe set a screen. A lot of room inside. See what the Panthers do. Try to have someone miss a slide. Kyle Page will go. Use his speed. Looks to the middle, nothing there. Swings wide, ball down, picks it up again. So has room, might get inside. Oh, nice save, good shot. Not much of an angle. Panther ball. Tom Fitch behind. <coughs> David Rice with the ball, back up top to Betzel. Finds Andrew Bartuzak. Lines switched up a little bit tonight. We we're down one midfielder, so we've switched some lines. David Rice on top with a dodge. Looks to shoot. Ooh, way wide. Might have had a hand on the stick. Panther ball. 121 to go in the first. 2-1 Panthers. Tommy Fitch behind. Plays catch with Kyle Page. Betzel set up inside. We had Bartusiak up top. He's going to look to dodge. Look for a screed from David Rice. Two men in the crease. 
Left to right, it's going to take a shot, nothing there. Pass across, ooh, didn't connect. Unforced there, there, Panthers, Peters ball. 55.6 to go. Panthers will make some changes, bring a long stick mini on. Michael Colian will come on, play some defense. Panthers a very settled ride. Make the goalie do some work. Skip across, ooh, ball down, come on guys. Good work by Colian, loose ball. Picked up by Betzel, man on his back, three men to beat. It's gonna get pushed out, ball is still in. Out of bounds, Peters Township, 30 seconds to go. Whistled in, pitch gives chase. Offside. Panther ball, 24 seconds. We call timeout, set something up, or just let them play? I think we're gonna let them play. Bartuziak runs across. Oh, finds Mats, and that's gonna be a penalty. That's a huge cross check from behind. But Peter's a little confused on that set. Panthers will go man up, 15.7 seconds to go in the first quarter. Another push with possession. Penalty, Peters Township, push with possession, 30 seconds. Yeah, there's a referee. 30 seconds. How? That's only a 30 second penalty. How's that? We're just going to hold and we're going to take that face off. So that goes to the end of the first. 2 1 Panthers on top. We're going to hold for possession on the start of the second quarter. I thought. We're back. Panthers up. Man advantage now. Start of the second quarter, 2-1 lead over Peters Township. Page behind, looks inside, goes up top to Rice. He's going to shoot low. Good save, Peters Township, ball loose. Betzel gives chase. About 15 seconds left in the penalty. Oh, they're going to wave him on now. He's back on in a few seconds. Ball loose, pick up David Rice. Going to shoot left-handed. Oh, got a chase. Peters back first, their ball. Penalty's released, we're even. Peters will run it up. Trying to get to the midfield line, get a lacrosse in the box. Watch it, trap him in there, we'll get that delay. Long stick mini picks it up, Panthers still giving good pressure. Failure to advance. Panther ball, good defense, good ride Panthers. Andrew Bartuzak picks it up. It's out there with David Rice and Ryan Betzel. Tommy Fitch with the ball. Back up top to Rice. To Betzel. Ryan Kincaid, wing side attack. David Rice back on top. Oh, look inside, nice feed, good finish. Andrew Bartuzak on the left hand. Good work, nice pass Rice to Bartuzak. Panther goal, number 44, Andrew Bartusiak. Assisted by number 37, David Rice. Nice work there. 10.43 to go in the second quarter. Panthers on top, 3-1. Going to go with a faceoff. We have Southern, Trevor Morrow, far side, and Braden Kybe at the faceoff circle. Boy, this is a good faceoff duel tonight. Two good face-off, man. Procedure Panthers, Peters Township ball. And bringing across far side, being chased by Colin Liss. <coughs> Pied on top, back up top. Urza, number zero. Look to dodge. Oh, look inside, nothing there. Panthers, good defense. Good close defense tonight for the Panthers. Got Alex Gallimus out there, sophomore. Colin List, senior. Mark Panko, junior. Good chase, Panthers, nothing inside. Shut that down, that's Braden Cobb. 
Back up top. Look inside, no one there. Ball's down. Kybe tried to scoop it out. It is loose. Ben Southern tries to pick it up. Not there. Trevor Morrow went on the action. Well, kind of scrum going on. Oh, ball down. Oh, boy. Coolian got pulled down. Or that is Galama. Sorry. Ball picked up. Time out. All right, 9.28 to go in the second quarter. 3-1 Panther lead. Upper St. Clair hosting Peters Township tonight in a nice cold night. Panthers are 2-0 on the season. Peters Township 1-0. Neighborhood rivals. Section game, first section game for both teams. Peters up top. Swing it side to side. We'll look to have some action decrease. Cutter there. Oh, Aaron pass out of bounds. Panther ball. It's when you yell shot from the sidelines. And the ref's just like, come on. <laughs> Trevor Moore with the pass, bring it across. Nice little swim move. Doesn't always work. Worked well there. Stepping in a box. Finds Tom Fitch. Back to Mac Matson. Kyle Page, far side attack. We have Betzel, Morrow, and Rice out there. Page from behind is going to look left and right. Oh, he's got two men on him. The slide pass. Oh, good save. <laughs> nice pass to Betzel. Better save by Peters Township. He drew three men on him. Got rid of the ball. Good play. Peters will clear. Try to step it across. Going to run into some traffic. Page, good hard work on that ride. Faked across. Oh. A flag down, we got a play on. Peters Township ball, they're gonna look to dodge. List says no. Panko says no, look across, ball down. Flag will drop. Panthers will see themselves man down. 8.05 to go, second quarter. Upper St. Clair hosting Peters. Where's my spotter? Where's my spotter on the call? St. Clair offside, 30 seconds. All right, that's fine. Offside, upper St. Clair. 30 seconds. Peter's man up. Ball on the outside. Panthers had good pressure tonight. Moving their feet well. Sheets up top. Finds his man. Shot wide. Might have deflected off of Galama's stick there. Offer moving on that shot. Up top the sheets. Looks to shoot. Oh, off the post. Goldie's best friend. Oh, a nice one bounce pickup. Ben Southern, good speed. Looks for Tommy Fitch. Oh, ball down. Oh, that almost snuck in there. Matt Matson on that loose ball almost pushed it in. Oh, loose ball. Goalie makes an error. Tom Fitch will chase. 7 17 and ticking. Second quarter. Panthers up 3-1. Very well played game. Very fast paced game. Oh, there's a ward. Peters Township on the clear. Steps it across into, into the box. Runs into Ben Southern. Looks to shoot. Shot high. Sheet shot high. Peters ball. Ball from behind. He'll switch to attack. Sheets back to attack. Peters will make a substitution. Tordansky comes on. That's a mouthful. Look up top. Right side top. Panthers doing a good job on defense, keeping the crease clear. Back up top. Tobias on attack. Oh, nice play. Good stick there. Ben Southern with a long reach and locked that down. There comes a cross. Oh, missed the goal. Got a shot off. Missed. Be 
Peter's ball. It's Pike on that shot. She's come in. Oh, lifts a stick. Oh, nice save. Gavin stood his ground. Well, that went in. Oh, I thought that bounced on the side. Oh, that was a garbage goal there. Peter Township goal number seven, Sheets. Oh, I thought that went on the side of the goal. Oh, yeah. uh, that wasn't even one you were like close in that. That was good save, and it just trickled behind and went in. That's a shame. 3-2, Panther lead. 5.54 to go in the second. Face off by Braden Cobb. He has Mark Panko near side, Trevor Morrow far side. Snake it up, ball's loose. Didn't see it, picked up by Peters. Oh, oh. I don't know, he looked like he had all stick on that, but looked a little aggressive. Just a push, that's all right, we'll call, that's a good call. Penalty after St. Clair, 30 seconds, push with possession. I'll go with that. Okay, Peters will go man up. Let's see if we can do on defense, 5.43, 3-2, Panther lead. Hosting Peters Township. Tim Kerr on a mic, Cody Lance on the camera, Selena Kerr spotting. Oh, she got one number wrong already. Let's see what Peters is going to do now. He's given us a couple looks so far. They're going to start with a 3-2-1. Right side, look up top. Little dump inside. Oh, good save. Gavin Keith square to the ball, the ball hit him right in the chest. Good work. That might have hurt a little bit, but it feels good when you make that save. Got a whistle here. Timeout, Panthers. We'll be back. It's Panther ball. We have a man in the box with 30 second penalty being served. Peters Township is a man up. We were able to get the ball back on an out of bounds play. 5.21 to go in the second quarter. Panthers on top, 3 2. Crosstown rival, neighborhood rival, Peters Township. Trevor Morrow with the ball. We'll see if he's just going to take him up the sideline. A little hesitation step. Use those fullback moves. You don't want to get in his way, that's for sure. Pass across, nice quick clear. Kyle Page with the ball. Steps it in. He's got Mac Matson to work with. Tommy Fitch behind at X. Kyle's going to look. He's got room. Come inside. Shot score. Nice play, Kyle Page. Boy, they can't leave him alone. Did it go in? Oh, it's no goal. It was side. No goal. We might have to go to Toronto to look at that one. UC Jokinen had a goal last night. We had to take it all the way to Toronto. Clearly on the side, ball back across. Peters works the clear. Can't leave him alone. Kyle Page, that's not a good move. Loose ball on the clear across. Goalian tries to pick it up. Kyle Page has it. Worked the sideline. He's got good speed. Out of bounds. Peters Township ball. 434 in the second quarter. Peters looks to clear. Panthers with what we'd call a soft ride, but they do pressure the ball when they come up about 10 yards from the midfield line. Easily stepped across. Morrow will chase. Inside the sheets. Ball far side right. Let's set the defense. Back at X. Uh-oh, that crease is too wide open. Someone slide in there. Gallimus, good play to keep his man outside. Good work. Oh, cutter inside. Shot score. Good work. Nice play. 36 to 42. Is that Rue, R-O-O? -O? Is that Pike? Is that Pike? I think or Pike, it'd be Pike. <laughs> Peters Township, goal number 42, Rue. Assisted by number 36, Pike. We're all tied up, 4.07 to go in the second quarter, 3-3. Three, three. <laughs> what did he say? What'd you say? Procedure, Peter's ball on that faceoff. Panthers pressuring up high. Peters dumps it in. Panthers can't get around. They've been playing very strong on defense. That crease was too wide open. Peters Township is pulling them out far, giving room inside. There's another curl inside. Ball's loose. Oh, it dropped, and Gavin was able to pick it up. That'll teach you to go inside, getting up slow, Sheets. Ben Southern looks to clear. He's got a Braden Kive up top. Come on, Braden, pick that up. Two hands. 
Loose ball, Tommy Fitch, nobody wants it. Betzel with a pickup. Peters bringing a man on. Panthers will make a little bit of a switch. Ryan Betzel has the ball right outside the box, finds Braden Kybe. Andrew Bartusiak comes in. Finds Kyle Page. Look for Cutter, fake nothing there. Matson to Fitch. Fitch to Betzel, back up top to Bartusiak. He'll swing at the Kybe. Panthers want to work that ball around the perimeter one or two times, and they'll go into the set off of that. Put one or two men in the crease. Page to Kybe, to Bartusiak. Maybe he'll dodge from up top. That's, he's got a set up now. Peters is going to pack it in the crease. Fitch will bring a man across. Bartusiak will swing wide, look to go inside. Oh, nothing there. Tried to find Fitch too well covered. Saw that play from way up here. Betzel giving chase, Peters all the way across, good clear. 2.32 to go, second quarter, tie game. Ball back at X, Peters will make some changes. Little jamming inside there. That's Sheets against Colin Liss. Or no, that's Ben Southern, Ben will have nothing to that. Okay, we're gonna see if we're gonna get Dodge up top. Moranny, that's not gonna happen. He's gonna look inside. Oh, boy, that did happen. Who, our coach? No, Their coach, yeah. <laughs> Who was that? Moranti. Is that Moranti? Number nine. Yeah, I'm talking Monty. 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 Peter Township goal number nine, Morante, unassisted. Well, all right, all of a sudden it's 4 3, Peter's Township. Upper St. Clair with a one goal lead, went up 2 1. Now down 3 4 2, 4 3. Ball's loose, 155 to go and a half. Pushed out of side. Oh, we're going to call a little bit of a penalty on that. David Rice will come to the box. Panthers coming a little unraveled here. Upper St. Clair penalty, 30 seconds, push with possession. All right, Panthers coming a little unraveled. Peters' man up again, 30 seconds. What they did last time, they opened up that crease area. Too much room inside for the attack men to dodge. Ball right side, lost some movement inside. Panthers have it packed in pretty tight. Good ball movement, shot score. <laughs> That's no good. Peters goal number 22, Bocacci, assisted by number seven, Sheets. Wow, just like that, three unanswered goals by Peters Township. Panthers coming unraveled. 138 to go and a half, we gotta get one here. Rice on the far side, Ben Southern near side, long stick midi. Braden Kive on a faceoff. Braden's a very strong faceoff man. Let's see what he can do. Peter's also a very strong faceoff man. Let's just pick the whole man up. Ball's loose. Not released yet. Ben Southern has room. Picks it up. Finds a crowd. Going to get a oh, timeout Panthers. That was a good timeout call. 128 to go in the first, 5-3 Peters Township lead. Three unanswered goals by Peters Township. It'll be Upper St. Clair's ball on the clear. Coming off a timeout, see what Coach Yates has. Whole new year for Upper St. Clair, new coaching staff, whole new philosophy, new system. Kids have bought into the system very well, very enthusiastic group. Morrow's going to use the speed, run all the way across the field to clear. Little dodge, looks across, we'll look for Fitch. Get it in the box. Trevor steps it in, finds Betzel up top, over to David Rice. Mac Matson back to David Rice. Panthers missing Colin Kerr, freshman midfielder tonight. Injury and illness. Wanted to play this game tonight. Page behind. Comes off a screen by Fitch, nothing there. Good defensive play to keep him out. 41 seconds to go. <clears throat> Fitch will try to curl, he's got that strong left side shot. Nothing there. 
Panthers got to move the ball quick. 35 seconds. First half down 5-3. Coming off a timeout. See what kind of adjustments they've made. Page dodges inside. Oh, pass a little high for Morrow. Let's get to the midfield line. See what happens. Down to 20 seconds. We're going to get a whistle for a push. Peter's ball. Clock ticking. Randy's trying to bowl through people, step over people. <laughs> Still has the ball. Look down low. Oh, good recovery by Southern. Five seconds to go. There's a clear. Madsen is not going to have any time. We're going to go to the end of the first. Peters Township, five. Upper St. Clair, three. We'll be back. Okay, we're back to start the second half. Upper St. Clair boys varsity lacrosse hosting Peters Township. First section game of the season. Upper St. Clair 2-0 on the season. Peters Township 1-0. Panthers had a lead 1-0. Peters tied at 1-1. Panthers run up 2-1. 2-2-3-2. All of a sudden it's 5-3 Peters Township. Kive on a face off. Ball inside. Peters Township pick up. Oh, it's still loose. We have a little bit of a box out. We're going to get a push. Panther ball. David Rice will step it on. He's out there with Betzel. Trevor Morrow will run on. We've got Kyle Page, Mac Matson, Tommy Fitch behind at X, or excuse me, at attack. We've got Kyle Page. Jay Panthers has some room inside. Peters Township will scamper back into the crease area. Morrow up top, finds Betzel. Panthers will work the perimeter. You've got to have that ball go around quick. Look for a cutter. Page goes inside, looks for the ball, not there. Back to Matson. see if he's going to make a dodge. He'll bring his man right. He's got time. He's got room. Oh, he hit post. A little better angle. Might have had that goal. He didn't quite turn the angle far enough. He had room. Good play nonetheless. Back behind. Kyle Page. Feeds Rice. Shot low score. Nice low shot. David Rice. Panthers right back in it. Panther goal number 37. David Rice. Assisted by number 22. Kyle Page. That's the way to do it. 11.04. Remaining in the third, Panthers right back at it. 5-4. Good work. Nice low shot. Scouting on this goalie is sometimes to go up high on him. He does cover low. It's a good skip pass right in there. Shot score. So we have Bartusiak near side. Panko far side. And Braden Kive on that faceoff. He's working hard inside here. Very good faceoff man. Peters Township also with a very strong faceoff man. So we haven't had really any clean face-off wins. Peter Township picks it up on loose ball. Two men to beat. Panthers hard on the ride. Toss back across. <clears throat> Looks to step across, pass inside. Peters has cleared. All right, let's go. You're giving him room. Too much room, man, up top. He'll settle the ball. Sheets with the ball. Looks to curl. Takes his man inside out. Looks like he almost was in the crease. Shot nowhere. Out of bounds, Peters Township. They'll step it back in. Peters makes an adjustment. Brings another man on. Curl shot wide. It's a good idea if the Panthers frustrate Peters Township attack men. They're good players. They like to shoot. They're getting a little frustrated. See if we can keep the pressure on them. Sheets behind. Ball up in the wing. Randy with the ball. Looks downside, finds Sheets. Colin List. Ben Southern. Mark Panko on D. Ball up, up top. Morani back. Low side right. It's Picotti with the ball. Back to Sheets. Ben Southern, long stick on top. Colin List near side. Got Panko and Columbus also out there. Long stick midi. Good. Ball up top. See what they do. They're going to try to clear out the inside. Braden Kybe inside the crease, watching intently on the crease. Let's see. They're going to work it across. Look for a switch. Nothing there. Now they'll set it at 2 3 1. Let's not forget about Sheets in the back. Top side right. Switch across the field. Looks to dodge. List with Chase, two men push, loses his step, back up, List, oh, inside, good good recovery. Nice play by Alex Gallimus, sophomore, 
close defender. He's in there for Christian Teal, who has an injury. Good work for the sophomore. Bartuzak with the ball, runs it across the field. Looks to step in the box, keep the push it. He's going to settle. Finds Kyle Page, a little bounce pass. Kyle's got room. He'll find Matson behind. Panthers make a switch. David Pencroft comes on for the Panthers, first time in the field tonight. Oh, loses a catch, a little cold coming off that bench. Peters will step it across, step it in a box, make a change. Ball down low, back to X. That Sheets looks to curl. Southern says he'll have none of that. Shot score. Someone was sleeping, pass across. Peter's goal, number 22, Bacacci, assisted by number seven, Sheets. Just like that, six four. What did he say? Come again? Missed that call from my silent reporter. Probably pronouncing the wrong name or something, but. Bacacci. I don't speak it in Italian. All right, we got Bacciocci on there. Okay, so they're watching the Peters on our local live telecast here. Well, look inside, quick give and go. That's a pass out of bounds. Boy, she just didn't chase that. Sort of gave up on the ball. Panther ball. Looks like he could have chased that down. So if Bacciochi does something again, we'll call that out, Beanie. Have a little linguine, a little spaghetti, a little Bacciochi. <laughs> 7.52 to go, third quarter. Peters Township on top. 6-4 section game for the Panthers. Oh, come on, let's go, guys. Pay attention. Okay, they're not going to whistle in. What do we have going on? We got a timeout call, mm -hmm. or we have a question from the Upper Saint Clair coach, Coach Yates. What's he want to know? We're going to question a call. What's going on here? Do we get an explanation from the ref? Coach Yates knows his across. Was an All-American player out of Maryland. Passion for the game, bringing that passion onto this team. I don't know what they're talking. What are they saying down there? I didn't see it. I don't know. Was that in the rules? Listen, coach, we made the call. We can't change it. I'll give us a little stop and play. 7.48 to go. Early matchup for the Panthers with a section game against a heated rival, Peters Township. So they're going to get a test early. They go on this weekend to play two teams from Maryland, a little varsity road trip. Back in town on the weekend. So it's Peters ball behind at X. 6-4 lead. Okay, Sheets to Bacciochi. Got to call that name again. Herzo up top. Far side right, down low. Going to look to have a give and go back up top. They're not going to shoot there. Nobody back at X. No chase. Bacciochi sets back there now to chase it. X comes back up, slides up top. Betzel on the defense. Trevor Morrow covering his man. Far side right. Gavin Keith intently watching that ball, see where it's going to come from. Look inside. Goes to Dodge. Oh, good defensive slide there. Good work by Mark Panko. Junior defenseman back up top. They have good ball possession going on. Peters is possessing that ball well. Now we want to get that ball back. Look inside. Shot score. Wow. Left-handed shot. Oh, a little taunting there, ref. Let's make that call. Giving a little to Brian Betzel. Might have to mispronounce the name just because of that. Herza. Let's, let's mess his name up. Peter Township goal number zero. Herza. All right. 6.54 to go. Third quarter, 7-4. Peter Township lead. Panthers had him on their heels. We took a couple silly penalties. Let their man up, get a couple goals. Let's see what we can do on the faceoff. Oh, we've got a procedure call, Peter's ball. Ben Tobias, sophomore midfielder in there now. He'll be out there with Mark Panko and Braden Cobb. Peters will make a switch. All right, boys, let's get the ball back. A lot of ball possession by Peters. We can't just start staring and watching them play. Looks to dodge, Kaib, nothing there. They'll make two more substitutions. 
Gallimus back far side. Ben Southerner give chase. Colin Liss keep his man outside. Far side across. 6-11 and counting. Third quarter. See if Peters has. Going to curl inside. They've had that rush and got a man free inside for a shot. Yeah, watch the ball, boys. There's a shot from way up high. Good save. Gavin Key sees that ball. Or did that deflect off a defender? Well, the defender's down. So that might have gone off a defender's foot. Or body part. I don't know if that's Ben Tobias maybe down there. So we have an injury timeout. 5.56 to go. Third quarter. All right, that's Benny Tobias. It was down. He gets himself off the field un unaided. So that's a good sign. Probably took a ball off the foot. That ball is hard. It's cold night, doesn't feel good. Back to live action, Peters has the ball up top. They're gonna make a little switch at top of the crease. Look inside, shot high, out of bounds. Peters ball, first man to the ball when it's going out of bounds on a shot, it's your ball. Peters Township bringing in for X, at Sheets. Looks to curl, Southern won't let him get in there. He's got room though, don't let him turn, get his body free, come on guys. Can't let him get his body turned. As Soon as you turn, turn that shoulder, he's got free space. Panthers got to regroup, eight to four. Peter's goal, number seven, Sheets, unassisted. And ben Southern did a pretty nice job there. He kept him outside, and then he stopped, hesitated for a while, and got his shoulder just turned enough to get that shot off. Now, he probably needed help from the, the, another defenseman in there. Let's see what we can do here on a face-off. Peter's face-off win. Steps it in. Into the box. Boy, he's got room. Colin List, good job on D. Bacciacci back to Sheets. I like a walking taco and a Bacciacci. I'm going to get a call from Mrs. Bacciacci on that. 5.07 to go in a third. 8 4 now. Peters Township lead. Boy, we got one back quick to start the second half. and. Three unanswered goals again from Peters Township. Loose ball, give and chase, call and list, stay on him. Stick to stick. Don't give him room, don't give him room. Oh, good recovery by the Panthers. Got a shot off into a bunch of Upper St. Clair sticks. Whistled back in for the Peters Township Indians. There he goes again. Sheet, sheet, sheet. Ah, nothing there. That's it. Make him feel it. Roll right over him. Good job. <laughs> Little chatter out there, I'm sure. Peters ball. They're just set up in a big old mush. That's what I see. He's got to be right on the crease. Push him into crease. Sheets right on the crease line. Back to Bacciacci. Up top to Filoni. Loose ball. Panthers are standing still. Let's go, boys. Put a little pressure on. David Rice will give pressure. Alex Gallimus. Ball back to Sheets at X. Cutter inside. Colin Liss will just leave him stand outside. We've got to pick that ball up. We need possession. It's time of possession. Oh, that's a hold. Come on. Watch the hold. There you go. Yeah, I saw that way up here. Panther ball on the hold. Using his free hand to hold Panther at bay. Whistled on. David Rice with the ball. Step it across. Run through a. Oh, that's a screen. Come on. You've got to call that. There's the flag. Good work. Yeah, Peter's getting a little cocky out there. Braden Kive set up that screen for David Rice and the Peters guy. He saw him. He just blew right over him. So he's going to get a little bit of a penalty time for that. So this is a play on just like hockey. You'll play on with a flag down until the ball hits the ground and loose. But it's a nice pass inside. Oh, better save. Come on, Tommy. you got to go high-low. Good try. Page to Fitch. We've heard that combination quite a bit of times. Man up, Panthers. Call. Unnecessary roughness, one minute. Peters Township penalty, one minute, unnecessary roughness. You know, so the emphasis is unnecessary. There's Ryan Kincaid. He finds Betzel back to Rice, over to Bartusiak. Tommy Fitch back to Kyle Page, looks inside, nothing there. Panthers on the man up. They got one minute penalty. Let's see what we can do, boys. Back across. Bartusiak to Fitch. 
David Rice sets up in a crease. Ryan Betzel back here. Ryan Kincaid on screen. Back up top. Rice shot low. Score. Nice shot, David Rice. Shot low again. He learned from that last one. Who passed that ball? Who was the assist? Thanks. Panther goal, number 37, David Rice, assisted by number 15, Ryan Betzel. There you go, Panthers, 8-5. Peter Township get a little bit cocky there. Take a penalty. We made them pay. That's how you make them pay. They can do all the scrumming they want. Procedure, whose ball? Oh, I don't know about that call. Peters Township ball on the procedure call. I don't know. They're going to step it in a box. 2.56 to go in the third quarter. It's rivalry Wednesday. Peters Township at Upper St. Clair. All right. They're going to step inside. Panthers look a little more on their toes, not on their heels now. A little inspiration from that goal. There's going to be a curl shot save. Easy save there by Gavin Keith. Saw it all the way. No screen. Peters will have the ball. Comes from X. Nothing there. Good pressure. Fine sheets. Good save. Two men on him. He's down. Let's pout a little bit. Pick it up. Peters Township ball. That's how you got to keep the guy. Attack men out of that crease. Make him pay. 2.22 to go in the third. Peters ball back up top. Left hand, right hand, dodge, shot, bounce. Good save, Gavin Keith, right on that ball. Seen a lot of action tonight. He's played really well, been very square to the ball. A little pass across over his shoulder. Braden Kybe finds Mark Panko. He'll run it across. Look inside. Oh, he had a man there. Couldn't find him. Mac Matson was there. They didn't connect. Peter's ball. And they're going to run it up. Panthers are going to mark up. Let's see if we can box him in. Let's double the ball. Cross the field. Tommy Fitch working attack. See if he can keep his man off. Steps over. 142 to go in the third. 8-5 Peters Township lead. Section game for Upper St. Clair. Their second home game. 2-0 in the season. Peters Township 1-0. They beat Pine Richland, another strong team. Alex Gallimus will work from behind. Good work to keep his man back. Using that stick well and using his feet well. Top right. Gonna go top center. That's Ronnie's gonna look inside. Oh, he finds a man, ball down, didn't connect. Pops it up in the air. Trevor Morrow tries to find the ball, not there. Oh, look inside. One man to beat, dodge. Oh, off the post. Good save there, that's a goalie's best friend. Let's see if Gavin will tap that post, a little thank you. 56 seconds to go in the third quarter. Peters Township with possession. They've had pretty much control of a lot of possession in this third quarter. We need to have him make a mistake, a little frustrated pass inside. Shot wide. 44 seconds to go in a third. Peters Township ball. Got one man to beat, Colin List. Not going to happen. Ball's down, loose ball. Get out of bounds. Get out of bounds. Ball's out. Panthers ball, 35 seconds. Who are we going to have pick that ball? We're going to have a speedy midfielder, David Rice. Notice I said speedy midfielder paused and said David Rice. <laughs> All right, David, he's got the ball. Smart play, bring it up, Dave. He's got room. Going to have a screen set for him. Steps it across, good work. Look for one more, one more. Nice pass, one more. Oh, nice backhand play. Nice play by Kyle Page. Boy, he turned his man inside out, back to front move. Beautiful play. 14.4 seconds to go. Panther goal, number 22, Kyle Page. Assisted by number 37, David Rice. Very nice play there. David Rice teasing him a little bit about that speed. Usually have Bartusiak bring that ball up or Trevor Mora, but David Rice does have good speed. Brought that across midfield. Found Kyle Page. Kyle Page just turns his man inside out. That was a beautiful play. Hope the Panthers get a little momentum off that. 8-6. Peters Township lead possession. Let's go Panthers. Panther ball. See if we can get one more. Braden Kive finds his man with the whistle. We're going to reset the clock then? What happened? That Peters Township ball? What's going on? 
little confused. Did he not whistle him across? And they're going to say you got to whistle across. Ten seconds to go in the quarter. It looks like it's going to be Panther ball. See if we can get a quick one here. Kyle Page is going to go from top. That's a good move. Kyle Page will take the ball, see if we can work clear on him. He's going to take his man one-on-one. -on -one. He's set up with a big defenseman. This will be an easy pass here. Very good speed, very athletic young man. Shot saved. Ah, it's a shame, though. Peters Township's going to get possession. 1.7 seconds to go. Whistle down. That'll do it. End of the third. Panthers 6, Peters Township 8. All right, we're back to start the fourth quarter. Tim Curran and Mike, Cody Lance on the camera. Selena Kerr spotting. Sean Morton on the clock. One more quarter of action. Upper St. Clair hosting Peters Township. Back and forth game. Peters had a little bit of a lead, got a little bit overzealous, I think. The Panthers have come back, made it an 8-6 game. Let's see if Braden can do in a faceoff. Braden Kive is a very good faceoff man. Although Peters has not wanted to clean, they've worked well. Good box out, Braden. Ball is loose. Come on, pick it up, Panthers. Get there. Loose ball. Peters picks it up. Long stick, Mitty. Back to an attack, man. Peters down chip ball. Let's see what they can do in his possession. See if the Panthers can use that momentum they had. Momentum is a big part of lacrosse. It's about ball possession. Panthers are coming off a, a late goal in the third. Bottom left behind at X. Top side right. Top middle. Oh, the sheet's a little limp there for Peters Township. So their attack man, one of their has two or three goals tonight and a couple assists. He's off trying to loosen up a calf or a muscle or something over there. Uh oh, someone's open wide away. Oh, come on, guys, pay attention. Boy, we got lucky there. Pass across the crease. Panthers were sleeping a little bit on that one. I don't know if Gavin was calling that out, saw his man coming open. Back up top. Going to be a dodge. You have Kybe to beat. Kybe will use his feet to stay with him. Left-handed shot wide. Peter's ball. Panthers got to stay on their toes, get the ball back, make this a tighter game. Good pressure there by Ben Southern. Don't let him inside. Push him in the crease. He's in the crease. In the crease. Oh, oh, come on. We pushed him in the crease, and we get called for being in the crease. So it's Peters Township ball. You can nudge him into the crease. I don't like that call. 10.34 to go in the, in the game. 8-6, Upper St. Clair down by two to Peters Township. First section game of the season. Run off a screen. Southern will chase. Shot, save. Gavin Key's been strong in that net tonight. There's Morani on that shot. Mark Panko doing a good job keeping them outside. Calling list now on Picani. Uh oh, they've got a switch. Oh, good recovery by Galamas. Good play by the sophomore. He's in there for Christian Teal with an injury. Ball out of bounds. Panther ball. Let's see what we can do, boys. Braden Kai will pick it up. He's out there with Dave Rice. We need a substitution. Betzel's going to run back on. Colin Kerr missing tonight with an injury. Boy, he wishes he was out there tonight. This is a game you love to play. Rice inside. Oh, he's got room. Feet inside. To, oh, nice feed. Mac Matson with a beautiful finish. Strong game tonight. David Rice, nice playing. Good finish by those attack men. They get the ball. They like to finish. Panther goal, number 21, Mac Matson. Assisted by number 37, David Rice. Just like that, it's 8 7, 10 minutes to go in the game. Woo. Panthers on their toes. Maybe the Peters Township Indians on their heels a little bit. Panther bench, very exuberant. Peter's bench getting yelled at a little bit. Let's see what we can do, Panthers. Let's go, Braden. Let's see what you can do in a faceoff now. Oh, it looked like he had a clean win. Ball was still loose. Michael Cullian out there, sophomore along the committee, giving chase. Keep that stick in control, Mike. Pass across, loose ball. Who's got it? Two hands, Braden, pick it up. Go. Off the page screen, ball's down. Kyle Page has it. Panthers have numbers. We have a cutter. Oh, that's a long stick mini. That might not work. Good work, though. Michael Cullian to bring defenders into the middle. There's a pass. Shot wide. Get there. Get there. Get there. Uh, nobody there on the far side. Keeper got to the ball first. It'll be Peters Township ball on that shot. Peters will bring it up. Kyle Page will 
give chase. Ball's across. Trevor Morrow will chase Colian inside. Ball's down. Loose ball. Back up to Brandy. He's going to fake a shot. Ball's back to Filoni. We can make a whole sandwich out of that. I like some Filoni on my bread. Filoni back to X. Come on, boys. Head on a swivel. Let's not give one up here. All right, Cheat's coming back on. A little bit of a limp to him. That's what you get when you go in that crease. We're going to let you know we're in there. 8.45 to go in the game. Panthers down by one. They were down by as many as three. No, they were down by four. We had an 8-4 score, so the Panthers have done well to bring back three unanswered goals now. Oh, Aaron pass. It's out of bounds. Panther ball. Sheets up, unhappy with himself. Who's going to run that Trevor Morrow swim move again two times tonight? He learned that swim move from that upper St. Clair swim team and had a really good success this year. Trevor Moore, come on, get past there. Trev, step it in, settle the ball. That's it. Good work. Let's settle. Get some time off that clock. Possess the ball. Okay, Ryan Betzel's going to go on. We've got David Rice out there, Ryan Betzel, and Michael Coulian's got to come off. We need another short stick midi out there. Andrew Bartuzak will run on. Ball's up top at David Rice, top center. We had Tommy Fitch on that scoreboard tonight. Tommy has the ball and attacks. Left side move. Oh, boy, he had a cutter in Mac Matson just a little bit high, didn't connect. That's a shame. We need to have some possession on that. Good look inside, just a little bit high. 7.38 to go in the game. Panthers down by one. Peters back to their defenser, defenseman. Panthers have been content to let them walk it up and then collapse on them, see if they can make a bad pass. Let's go, Tommy, get on that ball. Pass across. Mark Panko will chase. Little toss pass underneath. Little switch. Okay, we have Sheets back behind. Morani's going to cut. Stay on him. Don't lose him. Betzel, there you go. Ryan Betzel will cover. Back at us. Panthers have a inside tight. Little cutter inside again. Nothing there. Come on, boys. Head on the swivel. You got to see those cutters. Two men to beat. That's a ward. Come on. He lifted his stick up. Call the ward. Panthers bench trying to get that call. Back up top. Going to try to have an isolation. Bartuziak will cover. Push them left. Force them right. Look for a screen. A screen wasn't there. 6.33 and counting, fourth quarter. Peter Township possession inside their zone. Look for a curl. That Sheets wants to find room. Turn his shoulders. Save Gavin. Good, good save. Got to make him pay the price when he goes in there, boys. Ball back behind at X. Pressure by Colin Licks. He'll poke at that. Little shish kebab work there by Colin. Good, good work by the defenseman tonight. Great work by the goalie, Gavin Keith, tonight. A lot of shots on goal. That sheets again, far side. He has a little bit of a limp. That's put pressure on that. Colin Liss, he won't let him inside. Back up top. Far side right. Little step, move, turn his shoulders. Shot wide. Couldn't get his shoulders turned. Good defense by the Panthers. 5.54 to go. One goal lead, Peters Township. Peters will work from X, far side. Back up top to Ranny. Finds Rowe. Rowe's going to look to dodge. Can't get past Betzel. Ben Southern back on D. Alex Gallimus, sophomore. Good job on defense tonight. A lot of pressure for Alex. Done a very good job on defense tonight. No one's getting past him. Ball back up top. On a switch. Good switch by the Panthers on D also. We need that ball back, though. They've got a little time of possession in here. Okay, that's Moran. He's going to try to dodge up top. Nope, he flips it to his buddy. That's Rose. Going to look to dodge. Tries to get past Betzel. Doesn't get there. Flips it back to X. Second cutter. Nothing there. Good work by the Panthers. They run that second cutter through the crease. You think, all right, the cut's been made. The pass wasn't there. Trying to square his shoulders. Oh, nice save, Gavin Keith. 
Peters Township got past Alex Gallimus a little bit there. Still a good defensive play. Got his shoulder square. Got the shot off. Better save. There's a ward, too. He's lifting that stick. Call that. There it is. Oh, come on. Don't be telling us his hand straight. That's a ward. Panther ball. There we go. Got that call. See that way up here in the booth. You can keep your hand out straight, but he kept lifting the stick. You got to call that ward. 440 to go in the game. Panthers down by one. We just need one, tie it up, and make it really exciting. It's been a very good game so far. First two Panther games a little lopsided. A little warm-up games. This is the first section game. Probably one of the better teams we'll see this year. Trevor Mora with the ball. He's going to run across. Don't get in his way. Nice pass across. David Rice will settle. Senior midfielder. Step it in the box. Oh, he's going to keep going. He's not going to stop. Down shot low. Oh, just wide. Boy, a little bit of a uh, cross check after that play. No call there. A lot of times you get in the crease, you can, they can do whatever they They can mug you in there, and they're not going to make that call. That's pretty much the price you pay. Trevor Morrow, far side right. He's out there with Andrew Bartusiak, David Rice. Trevor's going to try to make a move. Go left side, strong left. Oh, oh, it did go in. He shot high. Boy, the scouting report was if you go high on him, you can put it in. And boy, that was a good scouting report. High in the net, knocked the water bottle off. Beautiful goal. Panther goal, number 24, Trevor Morrow. Boy, he took that dodge left side. Beautiful high shot. Scouting report was their goalie does not let him in low, but he will let some in high, and that snuck in there. We're all tied up. 3.59 to go in a game. Tie score. Panthers with four unanswered goals. Woo! This is as good, get, good as it gets, boys and girls. Panthers only have, let's see, maybe four more home games. You've got to come out and see this team. This is a very exciting team to watch. Check the schedule on the high school's athletic calendar. Ball's loose. Braden, we have a face-off. Ball's loose. That's it. Stay on a fight. Michael Colian, pick it up. Good job, sophomore Michael Colian. Pass across. Possession Panthers. That's stepping in the box. Maybe call a timeout and settle. No, we're going to keep going. Ball is loose. That's settle. That's settle. We have the Peters Township on their heels. Four unanswered goals by the Panthers to tie it up. Oh, you got room, Kyle. Oh, he doesn't go inside. I don't know if we do call a timeout. No, nah, we don't want to call a timeout. That'll give Peters Township some time to settle down. Let's keep the pressure on. Let's put the pedal to the metal. Their face is down. Just step on it. Right, Beanie, my spotter? Kyle Page behind. Finds Tom Fitch. Panthers set up in their offense. Little pressure from outside. They get aggressive. Tommy has room. Looks inside. Shot low. It went in. Oh, what a nice goal by Tommy Fitch. Boy, they gave him too much room, and he took it. Panther goal number 14, Tom Fitch, unassisted. Wow, what a nice goal. Boy, that'll, that'll, get the, that'll get Peters Township on their heels. That was a beautiful move. I saw he had space from here, got past his man, turned his shoulder, low shot. Timeout, Peters Township. Beautiful work, Panthers. Timeout, Peters Township. Five unanswered goals by the Panthers. We'll be right back. 3.07 to go in the game. Panthers just had five unanswered goals. Face off loose. Let's go, Panthers. Win that face off. Win it and possess the ball. Oh, good pickup. What's the call? We're oh, beautiful pickup on that face off. That was Mark Panko. Timeout, Panthers. We'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Coming off that timeout, upper St. Clair ball. All we need to do is possess that ball. Within two minutes, if you have the lead, you have to keep it in the restraining box. Panthers have called a timeout. This is as exciting this game as we've seen in a few years here at Upper St. Clair Stadium. David Rice will step it in. Referee will wrestle it live. He'll step to the 30, step it in the box. Going to work a switch with Tommy Fitch. Back to Kyle Page. Kyle work at X. 2.46 to go. Panthers up by one. Peters Township defending off a screen. Back to Fitch, we just have to possess that ball, keep it in tight, stay in the box. You don't need to shoot. We just need to possess it to the end of the game. Kyle Page there, takes a shot. Ball's loose. Come on, Panthers, get the ball. Good recovery. Good save by Peters Township. Panthers ball. Tommy Fitch will curl, go to shoot. Not there. Good smart play by the senior, Tom Fitch, at attack. Did not take that shot. 2.21 to go. At the two-minute mark, we will have to keep it in the restraining box. If they force you out of the box, it's turnover. It's the other team's possession. Well, we had Fitch inside, didn't see him. Matson will work outside, try to get in isolation. Panthers will clear the crease. Matson with a dodge. We got a lot of good stick handlers out there. 
Back to Kyle Page. Two minutes to go. Keep it in. Kyle Page, he's got room. Get there, Count. Oh, nice speed. Oh, Tommy Fitch just got tripped or fell down right as he got that pass. Boy, Kyle Page had room, found Tom Fitch for one more and just got tripped up right at the last second. 1.45 to go. Peter's ball. They might have possession. They're going to call a timeout. Come on, don't let oh, goalie's out. Don't let him cross it. Don't let him get it across. Tom Fitch will knock that down. Oh, good pass inside. Come on, guys, you got to slide. Peter's ball, 128 to go. Going to work back at X. That's Bocci, Occi, Bocci, Cocci back there with the ball. Back up top. That's Morani. Clock is ticking. We're almost at one minute. Oh, nice pass. Nice intercept. Boy, he telegraphed that, and Ben Southern was right on top of that ball. Let's go, boys. Get it across. Call a timeout. That's it. Good call, coach. Nice call there, coach. You don't take those timeouts home and get any prizes for that. Ben Southern a little bit stymied in his own end. Coach Yates will call a timeout, set up that offensive play. We just have to get it into our box, hold possession, and go home with a victory. 56.6 seconds to go. Upper St. Clair lacrosse. Section game, first one of the season. This is an early matchup. Okay, we'll set this up. 56.6 seconds ago, Panthers called a timeout. They'll set the play to work that clear. They just need to get it in their box, get it in their offensive zone, keep it in the box. That means that restraining box from the 30-yard 30 line, 30 line in. Ball is over to Trevor Morrow. Trevor's had a, all the Panthers had a strong game. Oh, the swim move almost didn't work. He's used it two times tonight. Oh, they're called a ward. Wow. Wow, boy, they did not call that all night, and they called a ward in a swim move. His, his stick was tied up in the defender. Look across. Oh, what a beautiful save by Keith. Oh, they had it right on the doorstep. Best save of the game, Gavin Keith. Ben Southern will run it across, a little hesitation. Oh, and there's a flag. Don't do anything, Ben. Don't do anything. That's a way to beautiful play by Ben Southern. Walk away from that. Beautiful play. Unnecessary roughness there, Panther ball. Let's see, what's the flag? Referees are going to huddle. 31 seconds to go in the game. Panthers on top, 9-8 with five unanswered goals. Let's see what the call is going to be. We'll get our call from our sideline man, David Rice. Don't go away now, folks. Let's see what the call is. We're still waiting. That looks like it's going to be two minutes locked in. Well, it doesn't matter if it's 30 seconds locked in. Not sure what the call is. There's only 31 seconds to go in the game, though. We do have overtime, though. Let's get our call. Call. Peter Township penalty. Unnecessary roughness. Two minutes locked in. David Rice will step it in. He's in the box now. They've got to keep it in. Makes his way through three people. Finds Kyle Page behind. Kyle's got good speed. Oh, watch that rap check there, ref. He's got to go for stick. 16 seconds to go. Clock's ticking. Panther possession. What a great comeback by the Panthers. Nine to eight, five unanswered goals. They went down eight to four. And some people might have thought, in years past, we would have thought, oh, here we go again. Panthers stayed strong. Solid effort by the whole team. And we've won it, baby. Go get Gavin. He had the save of the century back there, baby. What a great victory for the Panthers. Final score, Upper St. Clair 9, Peters Township 8. This is Tim Kerr signing off. Cody on the camera. We'll see you next time, folks.